This video is going to be describing a train table that being built at Robert's house. He hired a couple of carpenters to come over and actually build it. He took the drawings that a few of us came together at his house and put a sketch together and he just turned it over to the carpenters and these guys are super. He also wanted some electric lights. It was a little dark in the room that he was working in. So he bought these very bright LED type lights. As you can see by the building of the, by the carpenters, it looks like they're doing an excellent job. And they even made some changes to our drawings because when you start building it, they were able to figure out some additional ways to give us a little more room on the layout. It's hard to believe, but this actually started today, which is March 4th in the morning. And this is what it looks like by the end of the day. But I guess if you're an expert carpenter, this is what they do, and they did an outstanding job. As you can see, there's no legs coming down from the table. It all goes and connects into the concrete wall. There's one of the workers there. I asked Robert, are you sure they're level? And he said, I'll go take a picture and I'll send it to you. Well, there you go. That's pretty perfect. Now they were getting to the point of putting the plywood on top of the table or on top of the frame and it's coming together very nicely as you can see here. It won't be long and we'll, the group of us will go up there and start working on this. For the guys that help draw this out, you can see it's coming together exactly or very close to how we drew the picture. Behind that pipe will have enough room to be able to put a train that goes back there behind it. And for our controls, the power packs and all that, the carpenter built him this particular uh, shelving in here. He will be back tomorrow to finish it up. So anyway, uh, this is what it looks like at Robert's place and it won't be long and we'll be up there to see it.